Hey friends, if you encounter a blue screen of death error with the message wdfilter.sys, then please watch this video. Now, this is a system file related to drivers and the uh, statement for the blue screen of death error can be any. Now, they've mentioned the registry filter driver exception one. It could be any statement. That is not important. If it says wdfilter.sys, then read this. So, first of all, you need to understand that the issue is with the drivers. Okay. Now, uh, people start jumping into countless solutions like SFC scan and whatnot. But the point is that if it is an issue with the drivers itself, then you may not be able to fix it in every case. But we will try a few basic solutions. So first of all, disconnect printers, cameras, scanners and every other peripheral which can push drivers into your system to avoid conflict. After that, update the drivers. How? Right click on the start button, select settings from the menu. Go to the Windows Update tab on the list on the left hand side. Select Advanced Options, click on Optional Updates. If you find any optional update, check it, click on Download and Install and make sure that you have installed it on your system. Next solution is a System Restore. Search for Recovery in the Windows search bar and open Recovery. Click on Open System Restore. Choose a different restore point. Next. Choose a good restore point and then click on next once again and then click on finish and then on yes to initiate the system restore process and lastly you can try a cloud reset right click on the start button and select settings from the menu and then go to the system tab on the list on the left hand side in the right pane select recovery click on reset remove everything and finally, you can click on cloud reset to reset it from the cloud. Now, I'll tell you the purpose behind a cloud reset. So if the local image of your system is corrupt, maybe that could be the reason behind missing or corrupt drivers. But if you are downloading it from the cloud from Microsoft server, you will get a better copy of Windows, which will fix the problem. Was this helpful? If yes, then please subscribe to the channel. And if not, then let us know in the comment section of the video on how we could help you further. Thank you for watching this video and have a nice day.